Okay, everyone, uh, this is Julie. We're at Cattle Mills, Texas. We're fixing to do some shutters um, on this house. This shutters, I'm going to show you. Um, this home has a little trim with brick. Randy had to cut some um, backboards so the shutters will lay flat, and I'll show you that. So, this is the window we're going to be working with. And as you can see, it has a trim accent here so if you put the shutters on it's going to lay with the little slant so those boards that i showed you will go on the brick and then randy will put the shutters on that so it will lay flat <coughs> this customer has a brick color that you could use just about any color you could do like the pecan of her fence to bring out these colors you can do a black um, we decided to go with a dark walnut, which is more of these colors. So this home does have some pretty colors where you could do a lot of different colors of the shutters. But right now, we're going to unload the shutters and get it going. And we'll show you what it looks like. <coughs> so just so you know, this is how it looks <coughs> without shutters. Sorry for the cough. This is how it looks without the shutters. And you can tell this is still a pretty house, but it's just... This is boring, it needs some pop. So we're fixing to make it pop. Hey, Randy's putting on the backboard now. Okay, so just see how that all lays flat. It's not slanted. <laughs> you always want to put the screw underneath the boards to hide it a little bit instead of up here where they see it because concrete screws come in blue and stain doesn't hold to these screws so you want to try to camouflage oh, I need longer screws so if that happens that means you need longer screws or you need one of those little plastic tap things so there's the shutter I'm gonna show y'all before and after one side with shutters and one without See how it looks it just makes it pop that much more so always need shutters um just try to stay away from the old plastic shutters because they get sun damage and start cracking and fading the cedar it's just like anything with a fence or whatever you just have to put a sealer on it um but we do these we're having a special if you're in the dfw east texas area we're doing these installed for 125 a window so give us a call, 214-846-1096. Um, let's see what this does. There you go. A little too tight. Okay. Now we're gonna do the other side. So we'll put another backer board on this side up here to make it straight and even like that one. Because if you didn't have that backer board, like I was saying, your shutters would slant. This way it keeps it all flat.
Okay, we got that one on. Just see how it looks. Isn't that pretty? So much prettier. What do you say, Randy? <laughs> I say it's Sunday and I'm working. No bueno. Only because you had a whole week off. <laughs> True. Never make him happy. Yeah, okay. This is it. Please comment um, below if you think they're a lot prettier than they were without the shutters. Um, please like and subscribe to us. Um, we do all sorts of wood cedar project from barn doors to baby pet gates to fences staining we do patio um and pergolas and decks so give us a call again that number is 214-846-1096 and we service the dfw um dallas fort worth area in east texas thanks y'all bye